Welcome to This Day in Real Estate. The topic today comes from the chapter, Real Estate License Laws and Qualifications for Licensure. And so in the book, we have to go to the section that, um, as I get them down to it, will be uh, about the rules and regulations of your licensing test. And so the statute and rules important to real estate is the applic an applicant must meet certain applications and academic requirements and demonstrate minimal competency with regard to the real estate business. Prospective licensees must demonstrate knowledge of the real estate business, practice the Florida real estate license laws and certain federal laws pertaining to the real estate to be prepared for the licensure examination and to competently perform real estate practice. The licensee must be familiar with the laws regulating real estate business and with a brief uh, description of some of the laws here that uh, you need to know. Um, on the test uh, and they don't have all of them on the test they just pick some on whatever um, test that you be taken they have different tests that they give you um, uh, that have different questions but the Florida statute 20 organizational structure establishes the structure of a, the executive branch of Florida Florida's government the Florida Constitution provides for the legislative and executive and judicial branch of the government. The executive branch executes the programs and the policies adopted by the legislature. Le legislatures and the policies imp are implemented by the Department of the Executive Branch, including the Department of Business and Professional Regulations. And then we can, there's a numerous of them here, regulations here that could be on your test, but then one of them is uh, chapter 61J2, and it is the rules of the Florida Real Estate Commission. It is a set of administrative rules developed by the Florida Real Estate Commission pursuant to the rulemaking process outlined in Chapter 120, Florida Statute Administrative Rules, published in the Florida Administrative Code, FAC. Appraisals are in the Chapter 61J1 of the FAC. -C. And then the, we have a question here that would be on the test. And which chapter is a is a set of administrative rules developed by the Florida Real Estate Commission? This would be possibly on your test. And it is 61J2. And then the other question, the chapter of the Florida statute establishes the structure of the executive branch of the Florida's government. And that would be chapter 20. And then our last question for this topic uh, section is a licensed sales associate, associate may operate under what? And there's three, four different options here. And we go to the book and we go down to that section in the book as you study. And that would be the general licensing provision. The three categories of real estate license are as follow. The first one is a sales associate and the next one is broker and then broker associate, which is a broker that works under another broker. The sales associate is a person who performs real estate services for compensation, but who does not under and does under the direction of the control of a broker or a management of a broker or an owner developer, such as a a large home builder. So that is the three sections, the brokers and the broker associate. So that gives you an overview of the different uh, types of real estate agents. And so this topic I hope is, is uh, 
is going to help you with your real estate career, passing your, your pre-license, this could be on the test, passing your uh, state licensing. And if you're not looking to get into real estate, these short videos may help you with buying or selling your home. For the most, this is the largest investment in your lifetime. Have a great day.